Hello everyone, my name is Annette and you might know me on social media as Netters Plays. And today I'm going to talk to you about one of the scariest games out there, and that is Dead of Winter. Now, Dead of Winter is not just scary because it has zombies, but there's something even more terrifying out there. Crossroad cards, the exposure die, and all these secrets makes the game scary. Let me show you how. So here is the whole setup of Dead of Winter. Of course there's going to be plenty of zombies that you're going to try to avoid throughout the whole game, along with the special characters that you're going to have, along with plenty of secrets. These secrets can be either good, where you're trying to just live and survive by completing these different objectives, or they can be bad, where you have a certain betrayer in the group and you can't trust this person because they're trying to make you lose because they might be trigger happy. So the coolest part about these different secrets is that everyone has these secret agendas. They could be good or they can be bad, but no one can really trust one another. So whenever one of your characters leaves the colony in search of different items, they always have to roll this die. Now this die sometimes has no outcomes, they might get bit, they might get wounded, or even frostbite. You never know until you roll the die. Sometimes within the game, there's certain triggers which will activate these special crossroad cards. The crossroad cards will either offer the group to either give a thumbs up or a thumbs down, along with an individual player picking option one or two. Not only are they set in the theme of the game, but also, you're going to find out if players are people you can trust or if they're betrayers. So like I said, Dead of Winter is not just a game about zombies. It's also a game about secrets. Everyone has a hidden agenda, whether they're betrayers or not. And then these crossroad cards set the theme of the game. Along with you rolling these dice every time you explore or try to get something for the group, you don't know if you're going to come back alive or not. So if you're trying to find a game where you can play it for Halloween or any other like terrifying type of theme night, you should try Dead of Winter.